Derek, I know you're no longer involved with Aurora, but you were for a number of years, and just be interested to hear a bit more about that. I mean, how important was the international side to the collection of brands within Aurora? And kind of just maybe could you talk about the challenges of building that international side of the business? International growth has always been important. This is a finite market in the UK. Most of us have brands that are relatively mature. So to be able to grow internationally was the route to growth. Um, fortunately, our brands were very early into that. And because they were distinctive brands, they had that ability to travel. Markets, different brands um, appeal to different markets. I think that's part of going back to what, what does the UK have. I think it understands how to build brands that are unique, that have a distinctive identity. So caramel and um, of which I think, I'm not sure of the latest numbers, but I think about 60% of global sales are outside of the UK. And transport, we would always say in any major city in the Northern Hemisphere, there would be enough customers that if you put it right, they, you could open a store. But in particular, Russia, whilst it's a challenging market at the time, um, was absolutely tailor-made for caramel. An oasis with its more feminine um, style and approach, more print, was perfect for the Middle East. Interestingly, harder to sell in the Netherlands and Denmark where the sort of floral print, that sort of appeal didn't quite have. So initially it was that ability to have a niche, but to identify which markets would really be receptive to that niche. So they, that was the opportunity and also the challenge. And were you conscious that a Britishness was a part of what you were selling? Or were the no, I don't, I don't, our brands weren't selling quintessentially Britishness. Um, so no, it was our skill at creating brands that had a unique DNA, had a point of view. I think that's what we were experiencing. And I think also brands that had a unique understanding and a consistency for their customer. 